This lens is projecting a slide onto a screen. Now the image is inverted, but we're trying to figure out how far away that lens is from that slide. So in order to do that, um, we should see that we have H, O, H, I, D, O, and D, I. And uh, we know that this magnification is equal to H, I over H, O, but it's also equal to negative D, I over D, O. And so we should be able to get some kind of a ratio out of this. So let's plug in these numbers. We have negative 1.76 meters divided by 23.3 millimeters. And that's supposed to equal uh, negative di over do. Well, we have two variables in this equation. So let's see if we can find another equation somewhere. We actually know that do plus di, that distance there, is equal to 3. So let's mark that down. Do plus di is equal to 3 meters. So if we were to... Um, isolate this stuff and just multiply this side by, uh, let's make both of these a pluses. We're going to move the DO to this side, so we'll just put the D over there, and uh, well, that'll get rid of it on this side. So we can kind of see that DI is equal to all this. So we want to put this equation in terms of DI, so uh, let's move the DO to the other side. So now we can see that since DI equals all this and DI equals all that, let's just set these things equal to each other. So we'll say 3.01 meters minus DO is equal to the DO times uh, 176 uh, meters over the 23.3 millimeters. And uh, now we can just multiply both sides by this 23.3 millimeters. So we'll kind of put that over here. And I'll expand that, so times 23.3 millimeters minus the 23.3, and then here's DO. That's just going to equal DO times 1.76 meters. So let's go ahead and just add this to the other side, plus 23.3 millimeters, getting rid of it on this side. And uh, we're going to have to sort of uh, calculate this out here. On the left side, we have 3.01 meters times 23.3 millimeters. That gives us uh, this number here. 70133 is supposed to equal um, 1.76 plus 23.3 millimeters, which is 1.7833. And then here we're just going to divide uh, this side by the 1.7833. So we get 0 0.070133 over 1.7833. And uh, that should give us 39.3 millimeters for the distance of the object, 0.039 meters. Now that we know the distance to the object, we should also know the distance to the image. Let's just mark that over here. So we would take 3.01 minus the answer that we had over there. So we get 2.97 meters for the distance to the image here. So now to find the focal length, we just use the equation 1 over F equals 1 over DO plus 1 over DI. We can just do that in the calculator. Let's go 1 over the object's distance is 39.3 millimeters plus 1 over the 2.97 meters there. So, and then we're going to take one over the answer. So we find that the focal length F is equal to 38.8 millimeters. Awesome.